So, you know, one of the things about fruit is that it is very unpredictable. Sometimes it's very good, sometimes it's very bad, and you learn what to look for over time, you get experience, but sometimes uh, you fail still. Uh, that's just how it is. Uh, you can never really learn perfectly because there's so many trees in the world and there's so many farms and they're all different and uh, sometimes looks may deceive. So these peaches here, uh, we, we bought them a few days ago, uh, they look... Matt's actually said that he didn't think they were gonna be that good actually. I don't know why he thought that. Maybe experience from last year or... It's probably just my perfect intuition. Yeah, but you tried them last year probably and mm -hmm. learned. I didn't, but they looked really good, you know, just look at that, just like vibrant, vibrant colors and not that much smell actually, but okay, we bought them, I, I bought a bunch of them, uh, they're ripe now, but they are not good, they are super sour, a little bit sweet, but super duper sour and kind of rotten and alcoholic, fermented, and they never turned super soft, so they were probably just picked too early, just way too early, you know. Uh, so that, this is what, how we deal with that. It goes straight into the compost. Here in Norway they have a compost uh, system where they pick up the compost every other week. So that's really good. We could make our own compost if we wanted. But anyway, the, my point here is don't hesitate to throw away fruit. For God's sake, don't eat it. That's the point. Like we could say, oh, we can't waste. You know, we spent. Th these were expensive. These were like four dollars a kilo or something like that more than that five seven seven there were 40 kroner oh six dollars a kilo or something uh so that's pretty expensive and you know we could have said no we we can't throw them away we spent too much money on them we better eat them but you know that would be like wasting our own body because wasting our health because it's not healthy eating unripe fruit it's really the fact that it's sour in the mouth and it's like oh that means spit it out, spit it out. You wouldn't eat that in the wild. It's not food, unless you're dying of hunger and you're desperate, obviously, but we're not desperate. We got other fruit here. We got these peaches, which are super duper good. We got always got bananas on hand, of course, and dried fruit as a backup. Uh, so yeah, don't eat fruit that's not good. Throw it away. Don't waste your health, waste money instead. Better to waste money than wasting your health. I know it's hard, but you know, abundance. Go into that abundance mentality. That's what you gotta do. Don't go into the little, oh, I'm so poor. I, oh, I have only a little bit of money. Oh, a little bit. There's only a little bit of fruit. No, no. Go into that other mindset where it's like, there's an endless amount of money running into my life and I'm spending it. And it's just, imagine this endless flow of money, endless flow of energy. Uh, comes in the form of money, comes in the form of fruit, whatever. Fruit is super abundant, so don't hesitate to throw away the bad stuff and focus on the good stuff. Okay? If you're just getting started, of course, check out our free e-booklet about how to get started on a raw food diet. Uh, that'll give you lots of tips uh, on how to get started on the right note, on the right foot. I don't know. Uh, and uh, yeah, hope you're having a good day. See you later.